you doing? This is Jesse, the City Boy Prepper. It's been a while. Lots going on since I've uh, done my last video, but just wanted to get another one in there uh, to kind of get me rolling again. This one's going to be the Pathfinder School, the SelfRelianceOutfitters.com. It's their stainless steel bottle cooking set. A lot of people in my bug out bag video were like, you've got nothing to boil water, this and that. So I feel I owe it to them and y'all to uh, bust this thing open and show you what's in it. So that being said, let's get back to it. All right, so there are plenty of reviews on this on YouTube. I'm by no means a gear reviewer. I'd I, I like to be, I don't know, maybe someday when I grow up. But this is mine. I did a bug out bag video on YouTube and man, I couldn't believe the amount of uh, commenters who's, comments who said that, uh, man, you don't have anything to boil water. Uh, dude, where's your water? This and that. So this was in that bag. I just didn't open it up. And now today for you folks, I'm going to open it up just so I can show you all that. This is, like I said, by no means a review. But it does, well, I guess it's kind of a review. Um, anyway, very high quality outside material. Not sure what in the hell it is. But it does have lots of mop, molly and shit all over it. Um, it comes with a couple loops on both sides. It does have a big, long, awesome strap that uh, for some reason is not with me today. But they have a nice uh, logo on top. That is Dave Canterbury, um, who is very influential in the world of survival and bushcraft. Uh, check him out. Anyway, this is his company, obviously. Um, it comes with a couple pouches. Uh, this is a fish mouth spreader, also uh, used as a bale in this kit, and I'll show you that right here in just a second. Uh, it comes with a tin of mini infernos. Uh, Smells like straight up gas, um, and there's about eight of them or so in there, which is pretty cool of them to include to get you uh, started with your fire. Um, it also includes a ferro rod with a striker, um, which I thought sucked at first, and it turned out it was me who sucked because this thing throws up plenty. Now I can't do it. See, who sucks? Who sucks? It's not me. Okay, maybe it is. Here we go. Plenty, plenty. The beginner, folks, the beginner can still throw sparks on this thing, so you can too. Believe me on that, and it has plenty of room in the sides. I mean, it, you could throw a lot of stuff in there. I don't have this bottle kit set up at all, but I need to set it up because you could make a whole survival kit, uh, survival kit around this thing, which there is also a video of. And in the top, they have since adjusted this. I don't know why I keep slamming it, but uh, this there's a little more room in this thing now. Um, the new ones they have come up to about right here. And the reason for that is uh, so you can fit the alcohol stove in it. Also sold by selfrelianceoutfitters.com. I am not getting paid for that. But I just believe in the product. I love it. So I have to share it to the world. Inside the top comes the lid to the uh, boiling cup inside. Uh, right on top they give you a um, stove. A little personal size stove that you can you know, get your fires and whatnot going on. Uh, this is the 32 ounce stainless steel bottle um, that you can boil and it comes with a little logo on the front which is pretty cool. It has a really good seal in the uh, top that seals the water up good. No leaks at all coming out of there. Um, inside I have thrown a couple things which are, uh, let's see, potable aqua, potable aqua water purification tablets. I might need to check that up. Are they tight? Are they packed so tight it doesn't? Anyway, uh, and I have two packets of drinking water in here just to kind of get me going uh, until I can find something, a stream or a creek or something so I can get that water boiling. And also, just to add a little something to the flavor of the water, I threw in some Propel Energy Packets, Grape, and also some Crystal Light Caffeine Powder Packets, Grape, um, just to kind of get me going so it doesn't taste like shit. 
in this bottom section here, and I love watching people struggle with this thing because it's not that hard to get out. <clears throat> Maybe a little, but I get it out pretty easy. Um, comes the 25 ounce maybe 20 25 plus one uh, boiling cup it comes with handles and two holes and the holes being for the fish mouth spreader which spreader which when you get you have to bend out and then it gives you the ability to hang with a stick right here um, over a um, fire which I obviously have done a couple times uh, that's very convenient. Da, 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 da. Basically, that is the whole damn kit um, that they give you. Nowadays, like I said, you get an alcohol stove. I don't know if it comes with it or if it, you know, you had to buy the alcohol stove separate and then add it to the kit. I don't know. Go on the um, freaking website and find out down here. I'll like put it on here. I like, I've always wanted to do this. Do, 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 do. Now, zzz, get it out of there. Maybe. Did that work? Probably not. Safety first, kids. Type shit. <laughs> <laughs>